The name's Rex. But you'll call me Captain or Sir. Sir, yes, sir! I'm Commander Cody, your new boss. My designation is Trooper 27-5555, sir. We call him Fives. I'm Heavy. This is Echo. I want you troopers to remember. We're shoulder to shoulder on those front lines. Brothers! And sometimes we may quarrel, but no matter what, we are united. Rule one, we fight together. Th that's... me? No, that's Captain Rex. He's a clone in the Republic Army, just like you, Gregor. Those clones are warriors, professional soldiers created by the Republic, trained to fight and die, if necessary, in our war against the Separatists. We can use a Jedi about now. What's our plan of attack, sir? Follow me. The Force, made physical, a Jedi is. Comes great responsibility with that. Protect others. How does a Jedi? Hmm? Anakin, teaching is a privilege. And it's part of a Jedi's responsibility to help train the next generation. <laughs> Padawan would just slow me down. And who are you supposed to be? I'm the new Padawan learner. I'm Ahsoka Tano. Just teach her everything I taught you, and she'll turn out fine. You know, something makes me think this was your idea from the start. You're reckless, little one. You never would have made it as Obi-Wan's Padawan. I'll get him! Ahsoka, wait! It's a trap! But you might make it as mine. Let's just hope Anakin is ready for this responsibility. Ready he is to teach an apprentice. To let go of his pupil. A greater challenge it will be. Hurry it up, Jedi, or she dies. No, Master! Don't do it! I can't let you die, Ahsoka. I am not abandoning her. Your emotions are clouding your judgment. Ahsoka, I am so sorry. For what? For letting you go. For letting you get taken. It was my fault. No, Master. It wasn't your fault. When I was out there, alone, all I had was your training and the lessons you taught me. And because of you, I did survive. And not only that, I was able to lead others to survive as well. Thank you, Master. You're welcome, my Padawan. Ahsoka, have you ever wondered if it was right to ignore your emotions? My Master would say, our struggle as Jedi is to move past them. Letting go of our attachments is a difficult struggle for all of us. You followed your instincts. You have grown strong and powerful, just as I imagined. Master. Do you believe you are the Chosen One? How can I know? The force within him is stronger than any known Jedi. I've trained him as well as I could, but he's still willful and balance eludes him. I failed as a Jedi and I failed you. Seeds of the dark side planted by your master. I tasted only vengeance when I slaughtered so many to avenge your death. There are many contradictions in you and in him. I can tell you what I believe. I believe you will bring balance to the Force, that you will face your demons and save the universe. The only love I feel in my heart is haunted by what would happen should I let go. They had a relationship. Once, I simply feel she is vulnerable to her emotions. She is? Or you? We live in secret, Anakin. Like it or not, our relationship is built on lies and deception. Anakin, I understand to a degree what is going on. You've met Satine. You know I once harbored feelings for her. So you're close to her? I knew her a long time ago. My duty as a Jedi demanded I be elsewhere. Demanded? But it's obvious you had feelings for her. Surely that would affect your decision. Oh, it did. I live by the Jedi Code. Had you said the word, I would have left the Jedi Order. It's not that we're not allowed to have these feelings. It's natural. As a Jedi, it is essential you make the right choice, Anakin, for the Order. I understand my responsibilities. Remember your training, Anakin. Trust your instincts. Look deeper. You will find another way. The 
Republic military presence is the only sure defense against the Separatists. A Separatist victory means death for all of us. What are we going to do? Fight. But our training's not finished. We can do this, guys. All we have to do is follow orders. We're nothing but a bad batch. Failures. We're just clones, sir. We're just numbers, 99. Just numbers. We're meant to be expendable. Not today. Clones, you may be, but in the Force, very different each one of you are. To me, you've always had a name. Don't carry such a heavy burden on your own. When you have your brothers at your side, Heavy. If he is not here, we will fail. Not today, brothers. Well, maybe you should embrace the fact that you have a team. Today, we pass. We did it! You are right, you know. We are a team. All of us, 99. You're one of us. Today we fight for more than the Republic. Today we fight for all our brothers back home. Look around. We are one and the same. Same heart, same blood. Your training is in your blood. And my blood's boiling for a fight. We're soldiers. We have a duty to follow orders, and if we must, lay down our lives for victory. That's the price of war, Fives. Isn't that what somebody programmed you to believe, Captain? I honor my code. That's what I believe. Where is the honor in marching blindly to our deaths? Are you questioning my order? This is wrong, and we all know it! It's my duty here. are not independent of one another. No clone should have to go out this way! Fire! We are loyal soldiers. We follow orders, but we are not a bunch of unthinking droids! You are making a mistake by crossing me, clone. It's Captain, sir. You're all traitors! I used to believe that being a good soldier meant doing everything they told you. But we're not droids. We are men! We're not programmed. You have to learn to make your own decisions. What? Stop firing! They're not embarrassed! They're closed! What the? This can't be happening. What have we done? Surrender, General. It's treason, then. Why kill your own men? Jedi. Because I can't. Good soldiers follow orders. Because you fell for it. Good soldiers follow orders. Because you're inferior. Good soldiers follow orders. I... I had to. We thought they were wearing our armor, but it was... you. A disturbance in the Force, Barry. There is conflict. The Clone Wars. From the dead, an old enemy has awakened, seeking vengeance. So it began without me. The Jedi are going to lose this war, and the Republic will be ripped apart from the inside. Top, do you have any idea what you've done? In this war, a danger there is of losing who we are. I remember a time when Jedi were not generals, but peacekeepers. There are a lot of terrible things happening. A lot of killing. But you started when you murdered my father! It's the Jedi who keep my brothers enslaved. I'll never forgive you. I've come to realize that the Jedi are the ones responsible for this war. This Republic is failing! It's only a matter of time. Know yourself. You may never see your future if you remain a student. Know what you will become. No! Our combined strength will be rewarded. Mandalore will be yours, and Kenobi, this Sith pretender Dooku, and all our enemies will fall. And only the strongest shall rule. It appears this clone has developed a tumor. Someone did this to Tup? The true nature of the inhibitor chip must not be discovered by the Jedi. I can't believe it. They all have one. Organic chips built into our genetic code to make us do whatever someone wants. Someone powerful. Our enemy created an army for us. Someone who wanted to be Cyphodius. Cover up this discovery. We must. You look troubled, Anakin. You lied to me. How many other lies have I been told by the Council? Obi-Wan! And how do you know that you even have the whole truth? You cannot deny your feelings, Anakin. They are what make you special. My master abandoned me. And that's exactly what you did to her. You and your precious Jedi Order. It is the Council's opinion that Padawan Ahsoka Tano has committed sedition against the Republic. And thus, 
She will be expelled from the Jedi Order. Ahsoka, I am so sorry. About everything. Back into the Order. You, Maker. They're asking you back, Ahsoka. I'm asking you back. I'm sorry, Master. But I'm not coming back. She made the decision, Attic. Well, what choice did we give her? The moment there were any suspicions about her loyalty, the Council turned their back on her. What about me? I believed in you. I stood by you. I know you believe in me, Anakin. And I'm grateful for that. But this isn't about you. You can't take responsibility for the Soviet's decision, Anakin. The Jedi Order is your life. You can't just throw it away like this. Ahsoka, you are making a mistake. Maybe, but I have to sort this out on my own. Without the Council, and without you. How would you feel if I turned into a major disappointment? How well would you sleep knowing I failed you? Not very well, I imagine. Luckily, that isn't true. And never will be. Your noble flaw is a weakness shared by you and your Duchess. <laughs> You should have chosen the dark side, mm. Master what? Jedi. Your emotions betray you. Your fear and your anger. Let your anger deepen your hatred. Remember, there can only be two. And you are no longer my apprentice. I know where you're from. I know the decision to join the dark side wasn't yours. The Night Sisters made it for you. Silence! You think you know me? It was I who languished for years, thinking of nothing but you. Nothing but this moment. You can kill me, but you will never destroy me. I'm not going to kill you. But I will make you share my pain, Kenobi. I have other uses for you. I was framed because I know the truth. A massive deception. It'll be okay, Fives. We'll sort this out. Oh, you don't believe me! Don't do it, soldier! Get away from me! Hush! No! Hush! Sissy! Remember, my dear Obi-Wan, I've loved you always. I always will. I never meant to. I only wanted to do my duty. Vice, stay with me, Vice. It still haunts me. It's the day I felt my life didn't have any meaning. I was just another expendable clone, waiting for my turn to be slaughtered in a war that made no sense to me. Don't worry about me. You made me remember who I am. I'll make my way home. I promise. Live to fight another day, boys. Live to fight another day. He's doing what a soldier does. Sacrificing himself for the lives of others. I'm a soldier, like you! Everyone I cared about, my team, Back out. Back out. was gone. This is the end of the mission. The one in our dreams. The nightmares. Finally. Free. Over. No, fight. Throne fight. I've been in countless battles and lost many brothers. They were my family. My home. To the end we are coming now. No longer certain that one ever does win a war. I am. What's the point of all this? I mean, why? I don't know, sir. I don't think anybody knows. But I do know that someday this war is going to end. Then what? We're soldiers. What happens to us then? For in fighting the battles, the bloodshed, already lost we have. Yet, open to us, a path remains. Spirit, balance. Through this path, victory, we may yet find. There is another, Skywalker. Not victory in the Clone Wars, but victory for all time. Soon, the galaxy will be remade. The Jedi and the Republic will die. I sense a plot to destroy the Jedi. 
great care we must take. Hello, Master. It's been a while. Why would anyone walk away from being a Jedi? I understand wanting to walk away from the Order. I know. Skywalker, a powerful Jedi. You are yet unpredictable and dangerous. You can be. It takes strength to resist the dark side. Only the weak embrace it. It is more powerful than you know. And those who oppose it are more powerful than you'll ever be. We were trained to be keepers of the peace, not soldiers. We clones have mixed feelings about the war. Without it, we wouldn't exist. These guys are clones? The cavalry has arrived! Clone Force 99. The Bad Batch. All part of the plan. The plan.